the last thing I would mention is I really feel that case studies are a great complement to the other kind of quantitative data that I've talked about. To have a few people <clears throat> that you have narratives of how difficult their lives were before they came into your programs and what a life-changing experience has been, and you all have these folks, and many of them are well known in the communities that you work in, and to have a few of those narratives <clears throat> written up so that if in fact something doesn't go well with your program, you've got some counterpoint, or uh, when you're doing presentations to the county appropriations board where you're trying to get money to keep your program going, not only do you have quantitative data showing all of the positive things that you had, but you've got a real life person that sometimes they can speak for themselves, but sometimes you just want to have a narrative that you can put in there. You can't rely on these. If all you have is case studies, that's not good. But in fact, as a compliment, I think case studies make a nice compliment.